Good evening and thank you for joining us. Our top story tonight, attorneys for a 35-year-old accused murderer say they'll launch, launch a diminished capacity defense. It's for their client when he goes to trial this summer. That's right. Law officials say diminished capacity calls Nairobi Chandler's mental state into question when police say he allegedly strangled 31-year-old Kaylin Bishop to death last May. Chandler is being held without bail at Fairbanks Correctional Center, charged with first-degree murder and three counts of evidence tampering. Court records allege Bishop had been trying to leave a contentious relationship with Chandler when she went missing and was later found dead along the Richardson Highway. Authorities also say Chandler impersonated Bishop by sending text messages to friends and associates it's pretending to be her after she had already been killed. State prosecutors say if such a defense is brought forth, they want Chandler's mental capacity tested as soon as possible to avoid delays in the case. If the defense is going to file an affirmative mental health defense, it's months, months late. Um, if they're going to do that, it needs to be done and we need to let the case follow due course. There should be a deadline for that. The deadline already passed. It was within 10 days of arraignment. They understand things can't happen. I'm not going to hang up on a good cause, but they need to make a decision now because if that's going to be filed, it needs to be filed. I would like a deadline and a status hearing on that um, midweek so there's no due, undue delay. Chandler faces a possible life prison term without the possibility of parole if he is convicted. Trial in his case is set for the week of June 10th and is expected to last anywhere from 10 days to two weeks.